Take a look at the marijuana stocks. Sales of cannabis around the world could reach $15 billion this year, maybe $45 billion in five years. Big market. Take a look at Canopy Growth. That is the world's largest pot company. Earnings came out yesterday, and their sales of recreational marijuana actually came down in Canada, and the stock's off 8% this morning. Bruce Linton is with us. He's Canopy Growth uh, CEO and a frequent guest on the program. Bruce, it's great to have you back. What happened in Canada? Sales of recreational weed down? What happened? So a couple things. Uh, we basically sell, if we grow it in this quarter, two-thirds of it will be sold in the next quarter, and the ramp-up was a combination of the stores getting ready and us having the product people wanted. So it's kind of down, but it's it basically flat. Uh, what's coming through right now is the demand is increasing as the stores open up. And as we get to Q4, rather than selling dried cannabis or uh, oils in a gel cap form, we start being able to sell beverages, vape pens, edibles. And so it's just a, it's a layering on of new products, more growth. Um, so I would say the markets reacted more like retail markets. I think who's selling today is uh, mom and pop, and who's probably buying is institutional. Because uh, if you I'm, look at our sector, it's just growing and getting bigger globally, and it's just starting. Do you think maybe there's some pushback against recreational marijuana? I noticed that New York just tabled legal pot until next year. Legalization efforts seem to be slowing. There's a lot of pushback coming here. You've got to be looking at that. You've you got to be thinking, mm, I don't like this. Yeah, I would say the pushback um, should only come from people who are making a lot of money by operating illegally. We're not introducing cannabis, right? This exists, and what the governments are trying to do is regulate it. In Canada, they've actually pushed through the next wave of topics, which are going to be the beverages I've described in other formats. And we're seeing globally, um, medical research is the big deal. So we don't need the world to turn into a party. But when you look at, we've got 60 clinical trials we've either started or are about to start. So we can actually try to figure out how do we make people sleep better? How do we make uh, adults in long-term care at, at geriatric state, you know, be less anxious? Things like that. And so I think, um, you know, this is just a, a flow of growth, but it's a lot of capital we put out. Like, we had a business uh, in Q3 2018 that was running about 600,000 square feet and had about 55% gross margin. So a good business. And what we did is we got $5 billion from Constellation. We began spending it. Now we're running about 4.8 million square feet and turning that up takes some money, but it also kind of dilutes your margins. And now we can think that they're going to come back to where they were. And so this is short-term selling. Um, we're not the stock you buy in the morning and sell in the afternoon. It's the sort of thing you say, I think this is a big topic for the next 10 years. Okay. Uh, I introduced you as you are the biggest marijuana company in the world. Is that accurate? I mean, I'm, I'm, I guess I should refine well, my terms. Are you yeah. the biggest legal <laughs> biggest. growers of legal weed in the world? You are, I think. Correct. Yeah, we're the biggest legal marijuana producer uh, when you measure it by total amount produced, uh, market cap, uh, head count, um, you know, all the functional things, clinical trials. And, and we're just using this window. I'm not saying we're Amazon, but Amazon spent a lot of time creating a lot of value, and the rewards came as they now turn up amazing uh, systems and offerings that people can't live without. And what we're trying to do is use this window of time, which is a once in a lifetime for this type of topic, hmm. to create something that is very durable. And durable means intellectual property. We've got 90 plus patents issued now. And it means spending. Okay, big company. Uh, Bruce Linton, Canopy Growth. Thanks for joining us, Bruce. I'm sure we'll see you again. Thank you very much. I hope so. Thanks, George. <laughs> you got it, man.